fucking touch me. What the heck was that? Was it Dr. Anderson's decision to abort you? There's a very faint female voice coming through. Yes. What was that? What just happened? What did you guys do? We didn't do anything. There were so much. I, I Jeff! Down here. Sure. Yeah, grab my name is Tara. My name's Rhonda. My name is Dimitri. <laughs> Dimitri. <laughs> there he goes again. <laughs> no joke. <laughs> don't, don't. I can't f talk right. I, I think it's a no joke. <laughs> don't, don't joke. joke. Don't joke or no I joke. Think it's a don't joke. Oh, I'm sorry. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Lamar. <laughs> Page. Okay. I'm Jeff. <laughs> and I'm uh, Angelo. Exploring with Angelo, I explore places and find dead people who want to communicate with us. Actually, my real name is Jean Francois. Can you pronounce that? I swear it just said Tabernacle. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I think that was a good effort. Can you say, can you say Tabernacle? <laughs> what? <laughs> Whatever that was was just yeah, laughing. What is that? It's really hard to make out a lot of it in person, but in post you'll see. Oh, yeah. yeah. Dr. Anderson, are you with us, sir? Or Dr. Porter? Is that Porter? Perry. Perry, sorry. <laughs> Dr. Perry. Sorry. I'm French. He has an excuse. Yeah. We told you our names. Could you tell us yours? Is it Henry Henderson? Hmm. Yeah. Okay, so there's a specific spirit that I want to reach out to who's been trying to get in contact with him. Are you with us right now? I'm just going to, I think there's a dial up here to change how fast it goes. So I'm just going to do that. This is it. Help. Her. Who needs help? Who's her? Dr. Anderson, do you remember me re visiting your grave this afternoon? Had some... Yes. Yeah. Said, yes, prick. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I <laughs> <laughs> hey, don't insult the French guy. <laughs> oh. Are you in one of these dolls? Oh my god, what the
can touch me. What just can touch me? What just can touch me? Where did it touch you? Holy right side. I'm sorry. What was that? What just happened? What did you guys do? We didn't do anything. We were both just sitting right here. You guys both jumped in there. Yeah. Are you okay? Something like went boom. You burned your wrist? No, my head. Sorry, guys. Like, I've been touched doing Estes Method before, but it feels more like a tickle that was not a tickle. Do you think someone was like, kind of like, really like, pressed in and kind of like, hurt? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Can you give a mark? I don't know. No. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm so I'm so glad that you guys are in this room with me though, I will be honest. You going back in? Yeah. Oh my god, your ball <laughs> No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, be careful, babe. Okay. Did, did this, this clinic was your dream? You wanted to create this clinic when you were in medical school? That's why it was your dream? Jawohl. Jawohl. That's what I heard. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. Yeah, what? I have a question for you. Can you describe the afterlife? What is it like where you are at right now? Do you say prayer? Yeah. I'm not sure. Is it a very nice place where you're at? I'll put it. I'll put it. So you find it a nice place. Or they said, I'll prove it. Oh, yeah, maybe. Yeah. Are you going to prove that it's a nice place up there? No. Never something. That was too, it's hard, like to, too hard to hear. They're having a conversation. In the... Yeah, it'll, it'll definitely happen. No. Are you trying to, sorry, it's okay. <laughs> are you trying to talk to each other? Kim, it just I said my name. I, I heard it say that. I heard it too. Help. Kim's help. Uh -huh. I heard it through the Come here. You have our attention. How can Kim help you? Eva. It was a male voice. It went Eva. I think I heard it too. I, heard it well. too. I got major chills right now. Who else is in the room with us? This is my name. I'm, I can see all of us. What male knows my name here? Can you tell us some symptoms of tuberculosis? What's a common symptom? Her death. I thought I heard death too. Yeah, that would, that would be a symptom. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that would probably be the end of some Mm. Yeah, 
what what did it feel like when they did an uh, electric bath to you? We're kind of standing in that area. It was like right here. Right, right? there. Right there. The, the circle right is still there, there from the bath. Right here, yeah. Literally see the, the control panel. Control panel. Yeah, and the control panel is right there behind oh. Angela. What is it? I don't know. Was it painful? We tried. We tried. We tried. Yeah. Are you trying to heal people? We asked for, for help from Kim. Eva again. What's the male spirit's name that's trying to communicate with me? Come here. If you can't say your full name, can you say a letter? Initials. Some of the answers are so quiet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can you, you speak guys, louder, please? Do you guys have any questions for the spirits last night? Whoa. Are we talking to one of the people from this place? That was. Is this sort of. This is sort of. This is sort of a communication tactic to talk to anyone here. If you can let us know if you were involved or related to. What happened? Wildwood. What happened? Did you. Did you pass away? Did you pass away from tuberculosis or did you pass away when it was the osteopathic clinic? It's foolish. It's foolish. It's foolish. What's foolish? Do you like that we can talk to you and hear your voice? So was this place always known as Wildwood Sanitarium? Or Since it's been too long. Yeah. So the spirits here would know that, right? Yeah. Yeah, I would assume so. It's him? Yeah, What's before that said excellent comment when you said 1903. What's the name of this place? What's the name of this? I'm assuming. I'm assuming. Consuming? Consuming. 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 Dr. Anderson, you are buried in the same graveyard that bears the name of this sanitarium. What is it? Yeah. Can you tell us who's upstairs? Do you know their names? That was not very clear. Yeah. Can you see their names a little more clearly? Chelsea. Hope or hope. Okay, so you're clearly in the room with us. What do you want from the three of us? Oh, I don't know what that's saying. Grip. Grip. Are you going to touch him again? Your question. Your question. I'm here. That's good. Who's here? Where's Tommy? The button. Didn't have. Didn't have. Didn't have. Didn't have. Didn't have. In the river? Well, somewhere nearby. Yeah, he drowned somewhere nearby and he's here looking for his mom. Yeah. So he's just. Yeah. Yes, he lived in. I think uh, Zach told me that he lived in the uh, the only apartment that was finished. Oh, okay. And he drowned in the river. 
Yep. Yeah. Fortune. Hey, Tommy, are you, uh, are you still looking for your mom? <gasps> we had mommy and mom mm -hmm. upstairs on the third floor. Yeah, really? yeah come on, on Spirit Talker. Where are you right now? And why did you touch him? Personally. Do you know Kim personally? Home. Here. Whatever. Is this your home? Hmm. So, here's a theory with that. So, Kim upstairs gets, like, she gets visions. Mm -hmm. So, for instance, I think it's this case where they're both here but on different realms, so they don't connect with each other. That is so weird, you were that? just talking about that. So like, they're not seeing each other, right? Yeah. yeah, she's like, what if they're both here, but they're just, they can't, can't find each other. That's literally what I said in Tommy's room. Really? Yeah. Oh my God. That's freaky. Wow. <laughs> That's wild. Like in a different dimension. Yeah, because yeah. he's constantly looking for her, but then we think that we also contact her and they're both here. And so they just it's like, simply can't see each other. Exactly. And, and, and I've noticed that certain spirits travel to certain kind of portals, and other kind of spirits travel to other kind of, spo of portals. I kind of feel, in all honesty, that Stranger Things had it right. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of, in a way. You the voices back and forth, but you couldn't quite pick up where the voices were coming from. Yeah. Like you said, they're both, they can't see each other, but they're kind of like, Oh shit, that's like my mom, right? Like yeah. I can hear my mom's voice, but I can't see where she is. Yeah. That's a very, very Maybe good they stay because they can hear each other, but they can't actually find each other. Oh, yeah. That is a strange thing. It is Stranger Things. <laughs> <laughs> so. Whoa. So, Tommy, can you talk to your mom, but unfortunately you cannot see her? Is that it? Yeah, I heard a yes after. I heard something like and yeah. You should step on it. <laughs> I just got called out. Yeah, you did. I think you're in your head right now. Yeah. Stay out of your way. You can't. I think I'm in trouble. It is. What do you want from Kim? You've been asking for her all night. You finally have her full attention with no one else to bug her. Three men laughing. At what? At the woman? Deep. Spirit. My spirit. My spirit? That was clear. Spirit, were you not saying during your essence, I'm at the back of the house? Yeah, yeah. So that's weird. Whoa. And the weird thing, it mentioned a Jeep, and that's what we drive. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jeep, when she was, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I said you drive a Jeep. Yeah. He said yes. That creepy doll looks like me after Christmas time. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us, what was it like to be a patient here? That was a little kid. Yep. Mm -hmm. Tommy, was that you? Can you stop? Can you stop? Yeah. Why would you like us to stop? What? This man. I heard this man as well. He gets upset. He gets upset. Whoa. Are we making someone upset? And it was a that was a kid. That was I think that was a kid. 
think that's Tommy. I think that was Tommy. Tommy, is there a spirit here that is really bad and he's keeping you from talking? You got a beautiful lights on the on the ground. If you go walking over there, you're gonna see beautiful lights on the ground. We can light up mm -hmm. this too, and it'll light up pretty colors. Yeah. You yep. can show us your favorite color on that. There's green and blue and purple. <laughs> close to it. Just like that. I'll light up pretty colors. Or you can like kick it across the room. <laughs> Whatever you want to do. Don't worry, we got spares. <laughs> I don't want to do this. <laughs> it doesn't hurt you at all. It just helps us to know that you're here with us. What the? Oh, oh, that was a kid for sure. Something about loud? Are we being too loud? Do you want, do you want quiet? I want to know who's calling us out by name. Yeah. Initials. Give us anything. Literally. Hello. Hi. You can. Yes. Is there a spirit in one of the dolls? That you're oh, you know. Apparently, you know. I, I just got completely cut off. Yeah. That's very spirit. You can't just cut people off and have it. Why don't you try to tell us which doll you're in? Is it the one sitting on that purple I'm lucky. Give us a color. Header. No, you can't hit anyone. Mark my words. Who do you plan on hitting? Or who have you hit? Is it? Did you hit one of the residents here? Or do you plan on hitting him? Follow you upstairs. Yeah, I heard so, that. Are you waiting for us to go back upstairs? To do a seance? Will you come up? Is that what we're doing tonight? We're doing a seance? Yeah. <laughs> That's news to me. <laughs> I, I thought we were doing a seance. I yeah. Really? Yeah. That's what I would have expected. <laughs> would you like us to do a seance? Pause your camera again. Yeah. Is there a certain room you would like us to go to? Did you see that? Mm-hmm. Right no, they should be on the second floor. They're on the second I floor. What's going so on in the main floor. floor. Yeah. Unless they're uh, on the I don't know. It was a kid again. That's what happened when we were down here last time. We heard a little running. Running. There was only five of us, and all five of us were down here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's how bad it was. And Jenna, did we lock the door? Yeah. Yeah, I locked it. I relocked it after going out. <laughs> He's here. 
Who's here? I feel like somebody's walking right now. I feel the floor. Can you please tell us some sort of name? Don't touch him. I'm going to be pulling Kim out soon, so this is your last chance to give her any sort of sign or communication on how you want her to help you. Sitting. Are you sitting beside Angela? There's one chair left. You want to come sit here? Coming. Come and sit with us. Join us. Go sit beside Angela. Angela, put that red pot up there. Right there, yeah, on the chair. Go sit. This here? There you go. Are we putting a device on that chair? Go and sit beside Angela. Let us go there. Come and sit beside Angela. Come on over. Don't be afraid. Who are you near? We told you our names. Do you want me to change the frequency? This one? Do you like more this one? Will you try it? Try it. Oh yeah. Oh damn. Yeah, I never would have. Oh yeah. <laughs> I literally never would have realized that. I thought well, was like a wall here. <laughs> was it really you? Your hand didn't pass the 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 chair. Is there something in that room? Can whatever it is in that room come and sit on that chair or touch that device, please? That would be muchly appreciated, please. Just come, just like that, please. Would you like a beer? I have a beer. <laughs> I mean, it's like, yeah, it's, still, it's still pretty full. It's Hofbra original. It comes straight from Bavaria. It's like OG stuff right here. It's good stuff, I'm telling you. Worth it. Want to try a beer? <laughs> Offer it up. They might like it. It tastes pretty damn good. <laughs> here, you can have a beer. Dude. I don't know if that was me or... <laughs> no, no. I don't think so. No. No, because I'm like literally putting my hand on it. Okay. That's interesting. I don't know. So you're happy to have a beer? Is that it? You need a cigarette too? I got those. Show it out for you. We have beer packs from Canada. Stupidness. Yeah. <laughs> With the gross right, pictures. With the gross <laughs> pictures. <laughs> Although you got lucky today. <laughs> it's horrible. What's horrible? Me. Why are you horrible? At or axe, and then I heard here, this one. Look. Look where? Out of place. Is something out of place in this room? Out. What happens if we don't get out? Mm 
Mm -hmm. Hold on. Sorry, I'm so sorry. <sighs> sorry. I'm sorry. I still can't hear you. I gotta turn this off. What? You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> oh my god. How are you feeling? I feel okay. I feel like I could have stayed in there for a lot longer. Yeah, your body language and stuff is getting a little. Oh. Yeah, I just didn't trust it. I didn't trust it at all. Did you use to smoke? <laughs> How long were you here? How long was your stay here? Did you die here? Or did you work here? It was the what? I heard the post. I don't know if I heard that correctly, but... Yeah, we've been getting a lot of really good stuff. I mean, in this yeah. in this area, they were like, and like Zach told me, Dr. Anderson and and Dr. Porter were really, really, really religious. So, really? Yep. I didn't know that. What kind of religious stuff? Amen. Amen. Pray. 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 Yeah, and then we got an open spirit box session, we got God, like, Hmm. And, like, if you think about it, everyone was here dying, right? So they're praying a lot. Oh, yeah. for sure. Right? That's probably their main thing. Yeah. That would have been, like, common. Yeah. Are we correct? Is that what you guys used to do? Pray right here? believe in God? Dr. Risperi and, and Anderson, I always told you, you were really religious. Is that true? Can you pray for, can you pray for us? Can you pray for us? Maybe say the Our Father. Good stuff. Good stuff. Our Father, who art in heaven. Oh! Oh! oh. oh. Yeah, let's yeah. Keep going. You have the camera pointed at that, yep. right? Do you want... Hallow be thy name? I don't know it in English. I just know it in it's French. In French. Yeah. Not the... Do you know the Our Father? I'm going to say it in French. Notre Père, qui êtes aux cieux, que votre nom soit sanctifié, que votre règne arrive, que votre nom soit... Leave? Leave? That was probably like a deeper mm. Yeah. Just something not like us praying? Or in French. <laughs> or maybe you just don't like the French. Exactly. <laughs> something. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, it's French Canadian. It's not real French. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have a really French name, though. <laughs> but I'm clearly Canadian. I'm even part English on my mother's side. <laughs> English? English, yes. So it's like a, it's like. Copying us. Yeah, my great grandfather came from England. His name was Foster. Yeah, that's gotta be that one. Yeah, that's gotta be that one. Yeah, that's them. Imagine. Something up. Do you think you could set that device off again for us? Yeah, that was great. That was awesome when you touched that red light right there. That was great. Can you do it again, please? That would be awesome. Shall I pray for you again? Or maybe you want to pray for us? Do you want my friend to say our father again in English? Okay. 
We have other friends upstairs. <laughs> the creakiest house in existence. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least it's settled. In the house. In the house, yes. There's other people in the house. You know their names? Can you say one of their names for us? It's difficult. There's three ladies upstairs. I'm sure you're familiar with them by now. Can you say their names for us? We investigate. Oh. Whoa! Are you are you investigating? Us? Okay, uh, now I have. I just came up with a crazy. Theory. <laughs> 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 Whoa! They can see us, but we can't see them, and they're investigating us and making like random knock sounds until we react. Right? Yeah. Dude, th like that's what I would do. Yo, Omar, watch this. <laughs> <laughs> right? Slams the door across the hall. Is that it? <laughs> oh my god. Dude, that sounded like you. Yeah. I was so like that. <laughs> <laughs> the second voice. It sounded second like him. Voice. The second voice sounded oh, like weird. Yeah. Okay, and I was really. Yeah. That, was, that was a double ganger, man. Well, fun fact, Paige's mim um, attachment is a mimic. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. oh that was so weird. Slow down a second. Okay. <laughs> I thought this. Okay. I need to know what this is. Like, how did this come about? All right. So, we went to a place called Greystone Manor. Oh, I was there. Oh, oh, I no, was no. there last night. <laughs> I slept there last night. Okay, okay carry on before I say. Go ahead. <laughs> I want to know what happened. I, I want to know too. Well, we the lady told us that there's a mimic in the house and it mimics people's voices and uh, she's had yeah, um, she's had conversations with her husband, like thinking it's her husband, and he's calling her from different rooms, but he's at work. Mm. He's like she's like chasing him around the house, like why are you calling me from the yeah. room? Mm. So. We only put that together like what a week ago that it probably came from there. Yeah, cause but we've been having issues with it for a while. She, yeah. like, we were at the Conjuring house and she <laughs> saw me in a separate room. I saw her in two places at once. Yeah. Wait, what? Wait, you saw her? I saw her in two places at once. Okay, I was in a room weird. in the basement fi fixing the camera before we were about to film, and there was a static cam down the hallway with a wall between us. And she came down the stairs, saw the static cam reverse, and saw me fiddling with that camera. Walked but in the next room, and she's in that room fiddling with that camera. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Yes. House. That's Whoa. so weird. <gasps> what the hell is going on? <laughs> Yo, what is this? Whoa. Is that the mimic? Are you touching that? But it, it also it? happened at home. Like, yeah, my creepy. friend would see me walk by, and I'm not even anywhere in the vicinity, and she would hear me talk to her in the morning, but I'm still sleeping in a different room. Mm. Whoa. And who else has experienced it? On our last investigation at the hospital, uh, Mike was saying that he heard my Lindsay's name, so, and or our voices down the hall, but we were on a separate floor. That's what he heard. And I've heard Aunt Rhonda. Yeah, she saw uh, her coming down the hallway at Fairfield. She was never there. Yeah, she wasn't even there. So I, I think second floor. It, wow. it can take so this, forms this has been going for around. Yeah. Different location. Yeah. 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 Oh! I've seen my friend in the place that she worked yeah. before. And what's, in my house. So what's interesting is that, so yesterday, like I said, I was at Grace and Heather, who owns the property, um, I think it was approximately a week, maybe two weeks ago, she had a couple of guests that were there, and they have, she has this on recording. So they were, I think they were in the basement or something, you remember where like the pool table area is? Yeah. Um, she was recording and they were asking questions, and there was a couple who were not really paranormal investigators, and were just like, kind of like they were hanging out, whatever, and they just stayed for the day. So they were like, oh, okay, the place is haunted, let's go and investigate. So they went down the basement, 
and they started asking some questions, and the, the husband asked a particular funny question that I probably can't see right now. <laughs> <laughs> we, we will get all demonetized. <laughs> so he asked this question, and he started laughing, like kind of I chuckling. Know exactly what you know what I'm talking she about? She showed us. Yeah. yeah. And then there was another deeper voice yep. <laughs> that was laughing in the background that was completely different from everybody else and, there were, and she like played it back and was like what is that? Yeah. who is that that's so weird that. oh my god Greystone is wild yeah it <laughs> so was very you, wild like, you have an attachment right Yes. And you think it follows you? Like, no. Yeah, it takes form of whoever it wants. Yeah, voices, it faces. It changes. So if that was your voice, that would have probably been the mimic. Right. So now it's mimicking you, Omar. Yeah. So now when you go home and you go in the shower, <laughs> you're going to be like, oh, 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 thinking of something really funny. <laughs> and in the background, you're just going to be hearing, oh, 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 oh. it wasn't you. <laughs> At this point, you've been to a lot of places, so the yeah. odds are probably high. Yeah. <laughs> Like her up there, it's fucking crazy. Like on yeah. a daily, like everything. Mm -hmm. So I don't think I have one personally. Maybe she does. Mm -hmm. Maybe. Are they all the same? They're all the same. What? What do you mean by a they all the same? Because you go into places and you never know, like if whatever it is you have with you, you're bringing it into the atmosphere. Mm -hmm. Like maybe. It, the other spirits that are in that building don't like it, or yeah, yeah. You know, like, oh. So you don't like it when other spirits come in the house, is that right? Uh -huh. it's your mimic confirming. Wants to be the other spirit. Whoa. So did any of us bring someone with us? Oh, I know. I can. And you're maybe not happy about it. Oh, something touch my leg. Sometimes I wonder if that's why they're here. Why? Because maybe they're not even saying it to us. Maybe they're saying it to whatever is with us. Yeah. That makes sense. I brought a spirit home, but she stays in my house. She doesn't leave your house? No, she just lives in my house and bangs my dishes around. Oh. Oh. So wait, so you want to, you want some, okay. Okay. I, gotta, I gotta understand it. So you went somewhere. <laughs> a spirit left with you. Yeah. Went to your house and was like, this is nicer than my original home. Yeah. I think I'll stay here for a while. And exactly. That's amazing. Mine's well at the same moment. Break some dishes. <laughs> Break some yeah, dishes. if I leave dishes in the dish rack, she clanks them around because she doesn't like that they're there. Were they Greek? Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you just hear a dish smash and you just hear, oppa, in the background. <laughs> I think they just said Angela. Oh, wow. <laughs> Don't be surprised. It Angela happened the other night. Too. Now. Huh? I'm what? screwed? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> At this point, <laughs> is what it is. <laughs> Leave that dream. Leave that dream. Huh? Did a uh, spirit from the witch's um, house follow me here? He said my name the other day on the spirit box. That was really creepy. Yeah. Is that you? Yeah, it's the okay. phasm cam. The knocks. The knocks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got you guys make a lot of knocks. <laughs> Lately, something weird's been going on. You turn my light on in the studio for some reason. Is like a buzzing happening, or is it just my ears? Do you guys hear anything? Maybe they're trying to talk to you. I always have my ear buzzing, so I can't really. Are you <laughs> no, I, I, I um, because when I was in the army, the fires and uh, 
You call it in French, ecofem? You, you hear, always hear buzzing in your ear? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I always. Shell shock. Uh, kind of, yeah. Sort of. Yeah. It's kind of how I always hear that ringing in my ear. You always hear ringing in your ears? That, that one particularly. Mm. Yep. Same with her and her. We all like our abilities, sensitivity, whatever. It's been growing. So when you investigate, do you, um, like with the empath, what, it's just that? Like you just sense emotions and stuff for the most part? I can sense emotions. She's really good with like the feeling stuff. Yeah. Okay. I'll like break out crying for no reason. Yeah. I don't know yeah. I'm crying. Oh wow, so that's yeah, very exciting. So one of you feels emotion. Tara you, and I you are have a ghost that is Greek and breaks your dishes. <laughs> 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 have an ancient Okay. Yeah. And I have a cast out angel <laughs> following me. <laughs> so uh, oh yeah, all this. All this. We also see a lot of weird things. We're here. I heard we're here. Yeah, so like yeah. and a lot of the time we see the same thing. That's one of the weirdest. Yeah. You see, you see, you both see the same thing. It, it happens a lot of times. Yeah. We did upstairs. We both uh, yeah. Dude, that just said Harlis. Did you guys hear that? Yeah, I heard it. That was the, That's your boy, right? Yeah, I heard Harlis. Aldous. Aldous, that you? Are you bothering? Are you bothering the the, go the spirits of this house? Angry. Angry. Hmm. What's upsetting you? Probably whatever. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> your Greek smash. Your Greek plate yeah. smash. Yeah. <laughs> He's pregnant too. She's. Pr Wait, what? <laughs> I don't know that. Okay, <laughs> now she's. <laughs> Yeah, she passed away when she was pregnant. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, so... Yeah. so yeah. Really? Yeah. She's yeah. from Inn at the Falls. Yeah. yeah. Oh, we've been there twice. Yes. Do you remember that? Oh, yeah. So the... Oh, shoot. Okay, now I know where you're going. Wait. That particular spirit is following you? She followed me home. And she's living there. Do you remember that? Years ago, we went to... was this? The lady so went, who fell down the stairs. A brave spirit? Yeah, so we went to Inn of the Falls. Do you remember we saw, I think it was an adult spirit, and then there was a child spirit ne next to like the, the seat? Oh no. Oh, on the SLS. Oh, yes. Do you remember that? Yeah. On the SLS on Holy the stairs. Holy crap. We, yeah, we call it what looked like someone fallen on uh -huh. the stairs trying to like uh, struggle. Oh, wow. 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 Yeah. 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 I, remember, wow. I remember the story now. Wow. Yeah. Now that you said that, but like that's wow. That's and because it would happen in 1931, she was probably pretty young. Mm -hmm. I would say probably between 14 and 16. Dude, mm -hmm. that's like a yeah. that's like a mm -hmm. also heard crying. Like baby, baby crying in our room when we were trying to sleep. And that's that wasn't like that mean kind of the like classic. Yeah, room, the classic. Right? Room, yeah. 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 Yeah, so I talk about, home. Talk about weird <laughs> playback. Everything like, what's going on? Isn't that crazy? Dude, I'm not that been, ghost. <laughs> been, uh, Lauren and Chelsea and I <laughs> went there, I think, like, two, two and a half years ago. I got it on um, New Year's Eve. Wow. She came home with me New Year's Eve. Wow. Wow. Interesting. So she's not there anymore, if you guys know. <laughs> <laughs> she lives with me now. I took yeah. her in. Question. So, in at the falls is no longer haunted. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've been cold. I, I've been cold here. Jeff, I'm serious. Like, right here, temperature drop like 40 degrees. All around me, it's freezing. I've been freezing. I, I, I'm wondering, I, I, am I going upstairs? I feel I'm, okay, but it's, yeah, it has been cooling down. down I, I'm, I, I don't Yeah. I mean, I feel like we're just bringing, like, you know, all of our attachments. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah's here. Party. Yeah, Sarah's here. She's chilling. You know, yeah, maybe Aldis. we're just going to all these places and we're just communicating with our attachments. Yeah. Oh, we 100%. That's part of it. Yeah. Right. Well, that's what Adam Kimmel That's like, what we can get Edwin for you. Yeah, let's not talk about him. I saw someone? 
Yeah, I thought someone was coming downstairs. I thought so too. But no, <laughs> oh. <laughs> that was. I thought there were the girls were coming down. I saw a shadow on the water. No, it was like a person, like full person. Oh <laughs> boy. Know. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was one of the girls. What did Paige see on the stairs? <laughs> Is it Marissa? Can you ask Tommy to come downstairs and play with us? We brought him toys. Have you seen him? Hmm. Is that what I just heard? Yeah. You just saw have you seen him? Somebody's looking for somebody. Have you seen? He said, "Have you seen him?" And you saw somebody. Have you seen him? It's almost like somebody's missing. They're looking for each other. Yeah. Oh. Whoa. Wow. My mind is. Danger. So the mimic is not Sarah from Eight Falls, right? No, it's no. Two so it's two separate things. Oh, yeah, because you're saying. You got it from Greystone. Right. Greystone right. Manor, yeah. That's, at least that's where I thought. That's where, yeah. Because it's the kind of place we've been. And that's when it really started happening. Yeah. And then it really like punched me in the face when I saw you in two places at the Conjuring House. Like, no. Oh, dude, I lose my mind. And what's weird was I did not care at all. I was, I was like, you were just there. What the heck was that? It was like a speaker phone in the speaker. Phone. Yeah. That was weird. It's like, hey, we're weird. here. I could have actually sat there. Like a facility in a room, like a, like an institution, and the thing in the corner that's. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, like the PA. The PA, yeah. 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 Like pill time. <laughs> pill time. Tara. That's in my name. That's in Tara, name. yeah. Something else. Is that Sarah calling out your name's Tara? Is that Sarah calling out Tara? Is that two voices? Yeah. We got the name Sarah here last time. Yeah. Down so we, every once in a while spot. we'll get her name. Hmm. Um Sarah, you're in the wrong country. <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> How did you cross the border? <laughs> oh you're the only Canadian that can cross the border without a passport. Okay? Angel was just salty because he got there. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You had a hard time. I always have a hard time crossing the border now. I don't know. Okay, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> <sighs> It's been really weird ever since I went to go see Annabelle at the Phantasmacon. It's been really weird. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah, well, <laughs> it sounds like one. <laughs> we're having fun. Join our party? Yeah. Well, I think we're going to move. We got beer. It's at Sutures. Right now, yes. Yeah. Do you want some uh, Hofbra original? It's good stuff, I'm telling you. Straight from Bavaria. <laughs> Bavaria. Munich. Or I guess it's from yes. Germany. It's Muschen. That's a really cool word behind me. Yeah. What? Yeah, it's, yeah. it's definitely cooling That's down. Yeah, I, I, like I'm freezing. I think I'm going to call out me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Go yeah, yeah, I'm going to go upstairs. <laughs> thank you for talking with us. Yep. And thank you for touching that red light. Can you say goodbye to us? Oh, somebody sounds disappointed. Bye. Good night. Bye bye. See you later. <laughs> so we'll take another fiver, guys. Please, with this pendulum, can you show me your yes, please?
like that. Mm -hmm. Good. Thank you. All right. That was yes. That was from yes. Just saying. You good over there, Omar? I'm golden now, yeah. <laughs> Do you want to turn your light on or no, just no. leaving it like that? Can you stop it, please? Center it. Thank you. Tommy, are you with us? No? Okay, that's good. Can you stop it, please? Stop it. Please. Thank you. Is that one of the doctors? Maybe? Not sure? Are we talking to the doctors? No. Okay. That's good. Thank you. Thank you. You guys have a question? Just ask. Are we talking to the patient that was in love with one of the doctors? No way. Hello. So, with this pendulum, I want you to answer me. Were you in love with Dr. Henderson? No. Or maybe? Yeah, that's a maybe. That's a maybe. Okay. So were you in love? What was the name of the other one? Dr. Perry. Were you in love with Dr. Perry? Nope. So she was in love with Dr. Anderson. Okay, can you stop it, please? Thank you. Did you have an affair with Dr. Anderson? Can you stop it, please? Stop it. Thank you. Was that abortion, was, was it the baby of Dr. Anderson? I don't want a maybe, I want a clear answer. Was the baby Dr. Anderson's? Yes. You don't have to hide anymore. Yes, of question. Wait, I'm gonna. He's pulling my energy really strongly. I'm starting to sweat. <laughs> uh, go ahead, my friend. Yeah. I listen to this. I can't hear anything you all are saying. I'm gonna drink some bourbon. Meanwhile, I'll try to crack the pink, uh, pink quartz to see if, you, if she will react more to the pink quartz. So, no. 
<laughs> was it Dr. Anderson's decision to abort you? There's a very faint female voice coming through. Yes. It's like she's trying to speak, but she's having a hard time. Okay, you can stop. Look, the, 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 the pink quartz is really reactive. <sighs> a man just grunted. Oh. Dr. Anderson, are you here now? No. That's not what the pendulum says. You can't stop it, please. Another man just grunted. He Sto keeps going, Err. <clears throat> Stop it, Dr. Anderson. Thank you. Are you an entity that came out of an Ouija board? From the couple in the back room there, did you come out of one? What's that going to, Jeff? Yes. Really? Someone just yelled. Hey! Can you stop it, please? Stop it. Center the pendulum, please. Center it. Center it. Please. Thank you. Did you die of tuberculosis? Yes, and it's pulling towards the yes. Do you see? Mm -hmm. It's not swinging, it's pulling. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can bring it back, please. Bring it back. Just let it go. Thank you. I'll center it right here. Dr. Anderson, were you in love with that patient? Oh. It's like someone's trying to speak, but it's almost like they're going, hmm. Oh. Oh. Was it against your belief to get a divorce? There's no actual words. Oh. Go. Look how strongly it goes. Because of his religious beliefs, he didn't want a divorce. Okay, can you center it, please? Center it. Oh, fuck. <sighs> Look at that. Yeah, good. I'm sweating. He's channeling. Whoa. Is it bad that we are uncovering that we're in, you were in love with one of your patients? Four. Four patients? Were you in love with four patients? Oh, is it just this one? Found him. Four. I can. It's the meaning of four. Yeah. Tell us about the number four, please. Can you tell us about the meaning of four? Again. Yeah. Three. Was four the amount of mistresses that you had? No shoe. I know I 
downstairs. I said two of Well, at least you had four mistresses. Did you love all of your mistresses? Oh. It's pulling towards the yes. Okay, you can bring it back, please. Did you love your wife? Correct. Mm -hmm. Did you love your wife, Dr. Anderson? You loved your wife, why'd you have an affair? Or many? It's us. Was your wife aware of your affair? Here. Did your wife know? Did your wife know about your affairs? It's pulling towards the no. It's really a faint no. Don't be shy, Dr. Anderson. We're not here to judge, to judge you, sir. Can you answer again, please? Did you love all of them? Yes. Oh, yeah, I guess. Oh, yeah, yeah. What was the other question? Um, did your wife know? Yeah, you? did your wife know about your affairs? Maybe you don't oh, it goes to, yeah, no and maybe. Yeah, like maybe she knew, but yeah. she never said anything. I mean, back then you really wouldn't say anything because you were nothing about your husband. Leave. And the, 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 the wife didn't have uh, no rights back in the early yeah, 1900s. Exactly. And him being a doctor, he was Here. 100% the financial Here. supporter. So you had your affairs here at the Someone yelling in the background. Did you have your affairs only here at the Send. clinic? Send. Did you have to send some away? Free. Maybe his women here were free. Mm. <clears throat> oh. Did you have... Go. Did you have affairs with yeah. other women as well? Patients. Did you have affairs with other ladies that were not patients? Go. <laughs> right on it. Look. Yep. Okay. What happened? You tell us. How many women? Oh my God! Looks true. Yeah, that's strong. That's strong. Okay, okay, Dr. Anderson. Are you proud of your affairs? No way. Are you serious right now? Dude, I'm not even moving. Okay, Dr. How many women were there? Were there actually four of them? Can you stop it? Go. Can you center again? It's like the third time he says go. Are you upset that we're talking about this? The crystal is shaking. Mm -hmm. Oh yes. Tell us how many women you've been with. Can you center it please? Please. Do you know the amount of women you've been with? Maybe. It's like maybe and Stop. yes. Oh. There was somebody in the background talking. Oh. Whoa. 
Someone else is. Whoa. He does not pain? Like that we know this. Well, yeah. I'm sure your wife felt some Breath? Pain. Him. Us. Left. Pain, breath. Left. Left. Left us. Ahead. Quick. Sounds like someone was. Bad. And they would have been out of breath because they would have moved like they had tuberculosis. Some of them, yeah. That too. Yeah, that makes sense. He could. The voices are getting quicker, but it's hard to make out. Oh my god. Us. Go. I have to ask no. this. No. <clears throat> I'm calling upon Dr. Perry. Go. Dr. Perry, did you know that your us. partner in business had affairs with some no. of the patients? Leave us. Go. Shit. No way. Were you okay with that? Can you stop the pendulum? Go. Were you okay with that? Left, please, go. Please, Dr. Perry, were you okay with that? No. No. Did you try to put a stop to it? Oh, someone screamed. Is that what kind of stopped your business beside the tuberculosis outbreak? There we go. Go! He was having affairs with patients and Dr. Perry wasn't on it. Yeah. yeah. Pretty new, buddy. So probably when tuberculosis hit, it was kind of a blessing for him because... Well, like, because before it was like, people here, they would have diseases, but nothing contagious. Exactly. Sleep. Um, then just sleep. It just says sleep. Yeah. Go. Again. And quarantine Go. would have been a big thing. Yeah. So his <clears throat> lovers may have been gotten tuberculosis, has been quarantined. And this or during the osteopathic kind of clinic, kind of electric took el electric, electric therapy oh my gosh electric so wait, wait, wait. we're talking go. about someone that probably did that or got that therapy here because we came in contact that or he's i don't know i i, I, I i'm i'm fishing here but oh Are because someone who had electric baths here. therapy electric bath therapy Go. Or was it a way for Dr. Henderson to get advantage of some ladies with the electric bath therapies? I don't know. That's a possibility. Well, he's well, the last time that we were here, we kept getting bad. Bad. Mm -hmm. like Dr. Henderson was bad. The patients were telling us that he was bad. And we kind of wrapped it up. Well, maybe corrupt. Ooh. Oh my oh. head! It was like the, the head of the business. Ed. Ed. Was that Ed. His first name? Ed. No, it's Henry Henry Anderson and uh, Perry. I don't remember because I remember I saw the grave this afternoon, and yeah. it, it's like practically no. buried under a tree. You barely see the corner of the stone coming out. And I thought it was Henderson with an Go A, up. but it's H E. Go up to yeah. where? Which room? Are some of your patients hang out on the third floor? Or they just hang out all over the house. Hmm. So 
was. I, I heard something. Yeah, me too. I heard some, some shuffling right yeah, there. Yeah, Wave. Well, you're kind of waving your hand there. You're doing that. Wave. <laughs> it said wave as I saw her waving. <laughs> Dr. Anderson, did you feel a bit ashamed of what you were doing, taking advantage of those women? Go. Why do you want us to leave? Somewhere? Leave. Why? Because we're uncovering stuff that you don't want us to uncover. Your dark secrets. One of the candles just went Did one of you guys put that out? Nope. No? It went out on its own. Yeah. No way. Yeah. Wait, did you, did one of you guys put that? Nope. It went off by itself. It still has a... It doesn't have any wax though. Wait, you guys didn't put that out? No, and it still have a... Wait, how do you I don't know. What? That's what I'm doing. Back on. Because usually it's the wax that will put the the, the fire out, and when the, the all the, the the rope is burned, but yeah, wax. Oh, no freaking way, huh? Yeah, who? Huh. No. Did you put the candle out? Can you blow one of the other candles on the table? Can you try to blow one of those? Please. Standing ones, please. I swear it just said seance. That was really weird. I heard okay. something really strong, but well. I can fall, be gone. It was two different voices. Be gone again. Go. No. Two different voices arguing with each other all the Whoa. Way. So Anderson want us to go, but Change. I, I think the ladies want us to no. stay. Do the ladies want us to stay? Does Dr. Perry want us to stay? It goes again. No, it's probably a that piece of rope that's done. Wow. Ma'am. Ma'am. Seven. Yeah. 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 Black. Can you do that again, please? Yeah. Please. Knock my camera over up there. To prove that you're here. Yep. Are you? Yes, we are. I'm here. Can you try to move something, you? please? Seance. Yes, we're doing a seance. Can you see us? If you hear us, can you see us? If you can see us, how many are, of us are sitting here? You keep seeing. I, don't, I just keep see you. Look, I don't know. I just feel like there's somebody in that room. Yeah, like we're from earlier. My friend Tara <laughs> asked you a question. Can you see us? Yes. This is where we felt watched. Around. Can you center the pendulum, please? So, Me. Who was the little boy that Paige and I saw? Huh. Ava. Ava. <gasps> Maybe it was a girl. I do. Do you want Ava to come back? It's just 
is the same voice coming through over and over. But, bro, I think no, it's Eva. not. Eva was just here. I just asked if they want Eva back. Look. It's just, but. Did Eva remember, uh, make me remember someone? The voice said tap. Did Eva look like somebody you knew? Yes. <gasps> True. His. <sighs> Bro. I think I don't. I, I, I will ask uh, if it's Dr. Perry or Anderson. Dr. Anderson, is it you that Eva made me, you remember someone? Like a voice? Look. No, it's not Anderson. At. It's not Anderson. Something said at him, and then something said something else. I couldn't make it out. Can you center it, please? Thank you. Dr. Perry. I didn't even finish the I sentence. Yes. 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 So it's Dr. Perry. Yes. Eva looks like somebody that Dr. Perry knew. Oh, hopefully it's not one of his mysteries. Yes. So Eva, Eva had shorter hair. So what if one of yep. the tuberculosis patients had shorter hair at one point? Probably. You know what I mean? Yeah. So what if that's what they're trying to say. Yes. Or probably physically, and right. her face made me yep. him think, oh, she looks like, I yep. don't know, my sister, my oh. aunt, my cousin. Yeah. Come. So. Come up where? Mm -hmm. To whom Eva looked like? To you. Uh, Dr. Perry. Who he yeah. will make you make you think of? Was it your sister? A friend? A patient? Please, Dr. Perry. Yes. Uh, we said three things. We, we said three things. Was it your sister? Dark? Okay. Probably not. Was it a patient? That probably had, I don't know, some probably brotherly feelings towards. Bitch. Bro. Yep. yep, us. Dr. Perry. Help. Do you have something Him. against people that probably love people the same sex they are? Them, duty. Because back then. It's the duty of a woman to have their children. Exactly. And homosexuality was kind of a crime. Yeah. Your goal was to grow the population. Exactly. So yeah. if they had like a patient that was probably, I hate saying that was a, 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 a gay, more than a lesbian, she was gay. And probably Did Dr. You? Dr. Perry was trying to Thank you. cure her. Right. Because he's, he was really religious. And Eva made yes. him remember somebody. Eric? Hey guys. Dr. Perry. Hey. That was really creepy. Were you trying to cure patients of their homosexuality? I mean, shock therapy and stuff, right? Help. Exactly. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh shit, I hate that. Sorry. I hate Him. that. 
Like there were so much. I, I Jeff. <gasps> Sit down. I. I <laughs> Hold on. Oh, it's always like that when I'm getting somewhere yeah. and I'm getting and I'm scratching good. the wound. Yeah. They come at me. Chuck. Oh my God. Help him. Okay. Finish this. <sighs> Yes. It's so many different voices. Were you giving shock or electric hydroelectric therapy to patient? I didn't even finish my sentence and it's going. Yeah. For curing homosexuality. Us. And look how strong it is. Oh, shite, I hate that. Dr. Barry, okay, I'm sorry, video. sir, but it's not curable. You cannot cure a loving heart. Edith, us, <sighs> Sid. Was her name Edith, the person you were trying to Sid. Sid? Was her name Sydney? Maybe it's Sid. Or Cindy? Sorry. Are you saying that you're sorry trying to Keith? cure people from their homosexuality? You know it was an error? Say it. Keith, please. Did you regret? trying to cure those It's poor. just like a whole bunch of different voices. Okay. It's like they're asking for help. I'll use the pendulum. True. One. Dr. Perry, do you regret trying yes. to cure those people of their homosexuality? No shit. Please. No. Ed. Whoa. Hey. It's like going around, so he's not sure. Hell. It's like Sid. maybe no, yes. Sick. Sick or Sid or something like that. Please, true. Dr. Perry, be true. Did you regret trying to cure those poor people? Hell. Sick. Lost. Nope. Them. That's sad. I'm sorry. Help I'm us, sorry, but please. that's really sad, doc, Dr. Perry. That's really, really sad. One, one was abusing yeah. his patients, and the other one was trying to cure them from their homosexuality. Oh, great. Yeah. I, I'm sorry to have uncovered that, uh, Dr. Perry and Dr. Anderson, but When you do sketch, see, see. her. Can you give us a name, please? Oh, I am thirsty. Okay. Jack. Jack. That was a little kid. Please. <gasps> Four. Is it Tommy? Jack. Listen. Jack. Tommy, is it you? Are you looking for someone that name is Jack? Jack. Jack, are you the little boy that fish I saw? Truth? No. Go. Again? Go. Unfortunately, we can't go. We're sleeping here tonight. <laughs> I don't want to sleep in my Does car. Make for good? For again? For good? So in your head, you live. Doing that for good. 
you, you think in your head that trying to cure those people was good. Think. <sighs> Us. Oh my God. God. Different times, Her, different many freaking. Yeah, back dead. They didn't know any better, right? No. Believe. And, and, and that's the sad thing. In Go. their head, they were doing right. Hello. Well, keep in mind at that time, it, they made this God. public sphere. They were public sphere. Exactly. And then up until the 20s, that's when they started with the So it, I heard bitch. Just random stuff. Well, it's the government that come in here to build it. Yes. To, because it was one of the largest buildings in the region, I think. And it was the biggest place where they could park tuberculosis patients. And even though they were osteopathic doctors, they went through medical school. Absolutely. So they decided. The setup would have been like hospital-like. Exactly. So what better place to... Help! And probably parents bringing their kids to and us. Can you cure him from his homosexuality? And you know, that the kind of. Bro, bro! Dude, I was trying so hard. Like, I wanted to take that off like five minutes ago. <laughs> uh, but there were so many f different voices coming through all at the same time. We just uncovered that Anderson was sleeping with his patients and Perry was trying to cure them from their homosexuality. Oh, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> yep. bit, uh, Basically, and welcome yeah. Welcome to 2023. Exactly. <laughs> and man, it like the responses I had on the planchette and you were giving us what like matching up. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You, you were saying things I would take the crystal and ask the question and the answer would come. And not longer afterwards you would say something relating to the question. Oh, that's so weird. And you, when you said my name, because I was like... That was weird. And I was... That's why I was kind of like... I, I was getting... And when I uncovered that Perry was trying to... to cure people for homosexuality, you said, Jeff, like, like, shut up! Like yeah, Jeff! Like somebody's trying to cut yeah. Down for you. Oh, I. I mean, they did try and do that back in the day. It was yeah. very experimental. Yes. Yeah. Yes, and like I was telling Rhonda, some parents probably brought their daughter or their son, saying, "Can you cure him from his homosexuality?" Mm -hmm. And As for a them, man, he was like, yeah. exactly. And a doctor and a religious man, he would say, "Oh yeah, we'll cure him or her," because he, he when you said Eva. So that was, that's what all that was about. So I, all I could see is, dude, imagine all I hear is, ch -ch 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 -ch. yes, no, and I just see Jeff going, it's like it was like it, people arguing into your headphones. That's what it sounded like, yeah, and and, like towards the end, like the last like five minutes, it was picking up. Because it was like more and more voice. That's why I was like, I was dying so hard because I feel like I'm going deaf at this point. I, I'm pretty sure that some ladies wanted to come through to tell their story, yeah. but Anderson and Perry were like, no, you're not talking. Wow, that's interesting. Because you, you told that, yeah. the, you heard like ladies and gentlemen Listen, arguing. Um, it's 2023, okay? Like, you can let it go, you're dead. Yeah. <laughs> like, you don't have to worry. You cannot you stop a heart yeah. from loving. Yeah. Like well, there, there's, you don't, it's, Basically. It's so guys, I don't know if the first take was good. So this is the second take. So yeah, we uncovered some stuff. Uh, basically, Dr. Henderson was having affairs with his patients and Dr. Perry was trying to cure loving hearts from loving people from the same sex they were. So it was really interesting uh, so it sounds like we have to come back or i have to come back but thank you for the girls from paranormal xp to have come in uh, on such short notice and i know they came here before so that's why i invited them and go and subscribe to them because you haven't if you had 
If you're not, go and subscribe. It's late. <laughs> so go and subscribe to Paranormal XP. The girls are great. They're awesome. And they catch some good stuff. And this guy, too. Go and subscribe to Angelo. No one subscribe to Jeff. No free pizza for you. Yeah. <laughs> and that great guy behind the camera, my brother. And yeah. So guys, thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. And thank you for the new subscriber. And if you're not subscribed, what are you waiting for? And don't forget to like the video, all right? And until then, I'll catch you on the next part of Normal Adventure. See you then. Bye.